My name is Mike Arnoldi. I'm a Principal Solutions Architect with Top Down Consulting. I'm also a Certified Public Accountant. Oracle is phasing out support for Enterprise um, as of April 2013. What this means to you is while they will support the product, there will not be any updates, particularly for changes in third-party um, applications such as Microsoft Office. Now, the question the companies need to ask themselves is, is this level of support sufficient for my internal requirements? I think a lot of companies are saying, no, that's not sufficient. Um, so they are starting to make the migration. The features that you can look forward to in Hyperion Financial Management, um, there's actually several. First of all, this is truly a web-based application. It is easy to deploy to users around the world. Um, there are more dimensions in Hyperion Financial Management, which allows you to see your data at a much more granular level of detail and, and really to be able to slice and dice your data so you get a better view of what's happening. There are built-in audit capabilities, which can help you address issues such as your SOX requirement. Um, you get task audit, data audit, so you can see exactly what's changed in the application and who has made those changes. You can also design an application using metadata and rules so that you can reduce ongoing maintenance. Um, typically, when we do the migration, you're going to see a reduced entity dimension because in enterprise, we find that we've had to actually put things in the entity dimension that in Hyperion Financial Management, we can move to one of the custom dimensions. That gives us two much smaller dimensions and a smaller entity dimension reduces your consolidation time. The same thing is true with the account dimension. In enterprise, we typically build the sub-accounts into the account structure. A lot of these accounts really can be in the custom dimensions. The other thing with this type of application is in Hyperion Financial Management, the hierarchies themselves do most of the calculations, where in enterprise, I actually have to write rules to do all the subtotals. It ends up being a little bit smaller application with less maintenance. This can speed up your consolidation times and reduce your close cycle. Particularly with this type of migration, it's important to have a consultant that is familiar with both enterprise and Hyperion financial management. The majority of our HFM consultants have years of experience actually with both products, and you won't find that in many places.